Not many people know exactly what they are or how they work. Just told that it keeps them safe. Even fewer people know the truth. Australian beaches, renowned for their long and broken surf line and clean white gold sand, are among the most beautiful in the world. This lovely beach is a typical example. Shark nets were first introduced off the east coast of Australia in 1937, with drum lines following soon after. That's the very same decade Qantas first started flying between Australia and London. Flights could fit just 10 passengers, had 21 stopovers, and took a total of 12 days. Our world has evolved beyond recognition since then, but shark nets and drum lines have stayed fundamentally the same. Shark nets in Queensland are 186 metres wide by 6 metres, hang from the surface and sit in water 12 metres deep. Shark nets in New South Wales are 150 metres by 6 metres, anchored to the seafloor, also in water 12 metres deep. Both programs cover only a tiny portion of any given beach, allowing sharks ample opportunity to swim over, under, around and towards beaches. In fact, a high percentage of sharks are caught inside the nets. They've already been to the beach and are peacefully making their way back out to sea 